Welcome to Storytime with Anna. I'm Anna. Today I'm going to be reading a Dora the Explorer book called The Big Pony Race. Let's begin. The Big Pony Race. The Big Pony Race. One day, as Dora and Boots were playing in Dora's backyard, they noticed a trail of hoof prints. I wonder who these belong to, said Dora. They followed the trail to find a little pony standing under a tree. Hola, I'm Penny, the pony said. I was on my way to Pony Field for the big pony race, but I got lost. Don't worry, we'll help you. Dora replied. Who do we call when we don't know which way to go? Dora asked. Map! Boots shouted. At the sound of his name, Map popped out of Backpack's pocket. I can tell you how to get to Pony Field, Map said. First, you need to pass the prickly hedge, then cross the mud pit, and that's how you get to Ponyfield. Gracias, Dora exclaimed. Dora, Boots, and Penny began walking along a path. Before long, the prickly hedge stopped them in their tracks. How are we going to get past the prickly hedge? Dora asked. I know, Penny said. I'll carry you on my back and jump over it. Dora and Boots climbed onto Penny's back. Penny started to gallop towards the prickly hedge. But just before she reached it, she came to a sudden stop. What's wrong? Dora asked. The hedge is really high, Penny said. I'm not sure I can jump over. I know you can do it, Dora said. We'll help you. When it's time to jump, we'll shout, Salta! Penny took a deep breath and ran toward the hedge again. Salta! Dora and Boots shouted. This time, Penny jumped right over the hedge. You did it, Dora and Boots cheered. Dora, Boots, and Penny soon spotted the mud pit. The mud pit is too wide to walk around, Dora said. How will we get across, Boots asked. I know, Penny replied. I'll trot across the logs. These logs look kind of slippery, Penny said nervously. We'll count the logs together as you walk across so you won't be worried, said Dora. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. Dora and Boots counted as Penny crossed the mud pit. Muy bien, Penny, Dora cheered. We made it across. Dora, Boots, and Penny arrived at Pony Field, just in time for the race. Penny hurried to take her place at the starting line, along with the other ponies. The first pony to reach the other side of the field wins, called the announcer. On your mark, get set, go! The ponies took off, running across the field. Within seconds, they came to a series of gates. Those gates are high, Penny thought to herself. Then she heard Dora and Boots cheering for her. Salta, they shouted. Penny took a deep breath and leaped over the gates.
Next, Penny raced around a bend. In front of her was a large pool of water. The other horses ran around the pool, but Penny knew that it was quicker to cross the planks. How do I trot across all these planks without tripping? She wondered. Count them out, Penny. Called Dora and Boots. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. Penny counted as she trotted across the planks. Penny galloped into the home stretch. She could see the finish line just ahead. She ran as fast as she could to pass the pony beside her. Go, Penny! Dora and Boots cheered as she took the lead. Penny crossed the finish line in first place. Dora and Boots ran to congratulate her. You did it! Boots exclaimed. No, we did it, Penny replied. Thanks for your help. We make a great team. Hooray! Dora cheered. Lo hicimos! We did it! The end. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe.